Hello guys, today I'm here with a new tutorial, and in this video I'm gonna show, how to install Windows on pre-installed Mac OS. So before starting, if you haven't subscribed to the channel, then please subscribe to the channel, and stay connected for latest updates. So guys, let's start. This method can be used by Hackintosh users, or by real Mac users. Step 1 and Step 5 is only for Hackintosh users. Step 1 is to back up your EFI and any USB. For that you'll need Open Core Configurator, and any USB. USB more than 16 GB isn't recommended. Now back up your EFI. Step 2 is to create Windows 10 bootable USB. For creating bootable USB on Mac OS, follow the guide for my button. Step 3 is to partition the drive, for that, open Disk Utility, and select the drive instead of any partition, and click on Partition, and then select Partition. Now, click on plus button, and decide the size of partition you want to create for Windows 10. Rename the drive, although it's not mandatory, and now, click on Apply, and Partition, and confirm partitioning. Click on Done, and close Disk Utility. Now, plug Windows 10 bootable USB, and restart your PC, and boot to boot menu. Select Windows 10 USB, and press Enter key. Now, proceed with the installer. Select the version of Windows and proceed. Now, select the created partition, and delete the partition. Select the unallocated partition and click on Next.
Now, before proceeding, I'll recommend updating Windows 10. After updating Windows, restart PC, and let Windows complete updation. For real Mac users, the guide ends here, if you're a Hackintosh user, follow rest of the guide. Now, restart your PC, and plug backup EFI USB, and boot to boot menu. Select USB with backup EFI, and press enter to boot. Now boot to Mac OS. Now, mount the EFI partition, and delete boot and OC folder, and empty trash. Now, navigate to the following directory, and change the name of file. Now go back, and copy the boot and OC from backup EFI USB, and paste it to EFI partition of system drive. Close the folder, and eject EFI partition, and USB. Now, restart your PC. Now here, Windows 10 drive is not showing. To fix, boot into Mac OS. Now, Mount the EFI partition, and navigate to following directory, here, rename the file. Close the folder, and restart your PC. And here, you can see Windows and Mac OS both are showing. So, one by one, I'll boot to each OS, and show you hardware info. So, that was it, hope you guys enjoyed the video, if you have any question, just comment down below, thanks for watching, and don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe, for more update, stay connected and have a great day.